Hey guys, today's video is how to stop watching porn. So I used to watch a fuck ton of porn. Like I fucking loved it. I loved porn. Um, specifically like early high school, like I was a huge Riley Reed fan um, to the point where I just wasn't even watching her porn anymore. I was watching her YouTube vlogs. Like it was bad. Like I was in deep. Like I would just watch her Q and A's and shit. Like it was horrible. I Like they, there was definitely an issue. It'd be like her like daily like, um, like fucking vlogs where she was like, oh today I'm uh, I'm going to you know I'm cheating on my dad today, and I'd be like, oh come on Riley, like you're better than that. And um, yeah bro, like I used to beat off so much like because I think like I was working out a lot, the testosterone was high, you know, I was single, um, you know, it was like it was like I'd beat off you know three three four times a day and it's not even that i wanted to beat off you know it was like a thing I, it was like out of boredom like I, it's like ah oh, shit i have nothing to do might as well beat off you know um yeah it was pretty bad <laughs> and even like with a girl like if like I, I wouldn't watch porn in my relationship um when i started you know when i was in a relationship but like if it was ever like a long break or i didn't see him for like a month like, yeah, I'm bored. I'm fucking beating off watching porn, you know? <clears throat> so you want to stop watching porn. You know you're in too deep when you're buying, like, cam girls and OnlyFans. I can't even imagine, like, I got this close to buying an OnlyFans one time a couple years ago. Um, it was, like, this goth girl on Twitter. And I pulled my debit card out, and I started typing the numbers in, and I came to my senses as I was fucking putting the numbers in my debit card. And I'm like, wait a second. What the fuck? Like, I'm pathetic. I mean, cam girls is probably worse. Like, if you're giving money to cam girls, dude, you're de you're in too deep. There's no saving you. Okay. Anyway, so you want to stop watching porn, right? Um, it's pretty simple, honestly. Uh, it's close your eyes and use your imagination. And yeah, dude, it sucks. It sucks ass, but like, it almost it helps you train your imagination a little bit. You could start with that. Maybe like beat off to some thirst traps on Twitter. You know, it's kind of like a, it's like a stepping, it's a, it's a, it's a process, what is what it is, like, you, like, it's, I mean, I say quit cold turkey, you know, just fucking stop watching porn, but, like, if you can't do that, maybe you start beating off to some thirst traps, you know, fucking, um, oh, maybe you could try reading porn, uh, that's a thing I heard, I heard, like, that's what girls do, where, like, it's like Fifty Shades of Grey, right, where it's, like, porn, but you're reading it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, that's that's how much I was beating off, though. I was reading Wattpad, dude. It was fucked. I was watching, um... I was reading Megan Fox from Transformer getting fucked. Definitely worse things. Um, hentai is pretty, pretty bad. Uh, cam girls, once again. Once it starts... Once you start draining money into porn, you're... That's fucked, you know? <clears throat> I don't even really know where I'm going with this video. You know, I just kind of wanted to post a video today. It's my rest day, so... Um, yeah, dude, just stop beating off. I mean, like, here's another thing. Like, if you work out, right, and you got those callousy ass hands, and you don't use lotion when you beat off, you can, if you beat off too much, you can, uh, like, tear, like, micro tear your, the skin in your penis. And someone used to tell me that beating off too much actually makes your dick smaller over time, because, like, if you do it with no lotion, right, and you're stroking, um, that friction will create, like, micro tears in the skin of your penis, um, and then that'll get filled with scar tissue, which is less flexible than regular skin, so that you're actually losing like that, like minuscule size on your penis. And over time, your penis gets smaller. And maybe after like t like five years, you'll lose like a couple millimeters, you know. Which is like, hey, everything. I know that's for some people. It's like, oh, that's not whatever. Like, okay, but yeah, you can um, you cannot do that. You just just quit, you know, just don't beat off. I mean, like, it's gonna take mental fortitude, but hey man, if you want it bad enough, you know what I'm saying? I got 18 more days of my Instagram probation. Or 17 now, so I got 17 days left of my probation on Instagram where my shit doesn't reach anybody. Even though I think it's a decent video, maybe the videos are just bad, but it tells me it tells you an account status nowadays, which is cool. Um yeah, but, uh, yeah, just don't watch porn. I know, like, if you, like, I can name a lot of porn stars, you know, that's already a problem. You know, it's like, oh, who's my top five? I can give them to you like that. Like that. Um, and that's not a good thing. You know, you don't want that. <laughs> uh, 
it's like you're a fan almost but um yeah man i don't know today's just kind of a chill video uh i'll just throw in the other thing i made i wasn't gonna post it but you know just to fill up time so i got bitched at chipotle so yeah man all right also one more thing when you're having like when you're beating off you're just like ruining your chances for actually going out and finding sex you know what i'm saying like as great as porn can be is it better than actual sex like absolutely not you know what i'm saying like busting deep inside is way better than beating off and then cleaning it up with like an old towel you know um and plus it i don't know I don't know all the downsides of porn, but it can't be good. You know, you don't want to, you don't want to like, I mean, I, I, I think I've explained the whole Larry Wheels thing. He was addicted to cam girls, right? And Larry Wheels, you know how much money he makes, you know? It's like, he was making like over 100K a month, right? And other than like basic necessities, like bills and shit, um, he spent all his money on cam girls, like 10 grand a day type shit. Um, and not, on top of that, not only that, but he had a girlfriend, and he, you know Larry Wheels, he's strong as fuck. His grip strength was so powerful that when he would beat off, it killed the nerves in his penis. So, it like, so like, not only was he wasting all his money on cam girls, but he couldn't feel anything in his penis anymore for a while, till the nerves he built, he had to he had to beat off like this, like with two fingers, like this, because he was just so strong. Um, so if you're a lifter, you're worried about that. Like, I know we're not, none of us are layer wheels, but, um, shit, you don't want that either. That sounds undesirable. Uh, and on, on top of that, like, it, like, think about when you first started watching porn, you're just watching the vanilla shit, like, on the front page of Pornhub, right? Fast forward six months, you're on some crazy website watching some fucking insane shit go down, like, triple fisting, gangbang shit. Um, and you're like, how the fuck did I get here? You know, like that's fucked. You know, it's like, oh my God, she's got like two people's fists inside of her. And it's just like, and that's what you need to nut now. Like that's, that's not good. You know, I hope you guys are doing good, man. I, uh, kind of annoyed by the whole Instagram thing. You know, I'm just kind of like. I don't even know like I feel like I have no direction right now I'm like just like I have to take the semester off like I'm kind of just doing random shit use code uh, retaliation or code horse meat on retaliation and bucked up in iron crew so um yeah man I uh, hope you guys are doing good I will uh yeah I'm gonna add that other thing tell you about how I got bitched at a Chipotle a couple years ago it doesn't really happen anymore but y'all remember when chipotle workers would like ration their fucking scoops like you'd ask for a scoop of chicken and they give you like the little corner of the fucking spoon like well i mean like i'm not trying to be a bitch right now but i am paying for this shit you know and i i at least want like a full you know goddamn scoop there was this girl there right she was like vaping on my food and shit i was like hey um yeah let me get a bowl with some chicken you know, she puts the chicken in there and just gives me the little corner of the spoon. And I'm like, oh, is, would, it, would it be cool if uh, I got a little more? That wasn't really like a full scoop. Looks at me and she goes, actually, no, no, that's uh, that's all that's all I can give you. And I'm like, um, yeah, but that wasn't like a full scoop or anything. She's like, uh, yeah, it actually was. And I'm like, what the fuck? Like, are like, do you get paid to ration? Like, are we in fucking? Uh, wartime is this war I didn't know we were rationing shit out I had a long day so I was like alright you know what let me get the double then okay just give me a scoop on top of that um, and then it'll be fine like I'll deal with a scoop and a half like I know it's a lot of money and, uh, so she's like okay and does the same shit for the second scoop so and I, I, I truly believe that these two scoops combined were less than one normal scoop that's how little fucking chicken she put in my my bowl upset and now i'm like you know that's that's not double chicken and she's like that's double chicken like what like what do you want she's like getting angry at me and shit and i'm like oh like you that's that that's not like i it's not i'm looking at it and the dude next to me is looking at it like shaking his head because he knew i was right <clears throat> i was just like all right well like do I gotta pay for the double? And she's like, yeah, you fucking do. Um, and in my head, I'm like, bitch, like, 
scoop some goddamn chicken and put it in my fucking bowl now. But I didn't say that because I was, I went like a pussy. And I was just like, okay. And then she packed my shit up. Uh, barely put any pico or anything in there. Um, and then I walked out of there feeling like a pussy. You know what I'm saying? And I was like, wow. I'm a fucking bitch. I just spent like 18 bucks on a Chipotle bowl and that has nothing in it. And then I ate it and like the fact that I was like a, like I went like a bitch, I could taste like my pussiness in there at the time and it made the food taste bad. Now I, what I should have done is like, bitch, I'm not gonna pay for that shit. You better dump it out because I'm about to walk out of here right now if you don't put another fucking scoop on my bowl. You know, but I was just shy at the time and you know, I, I don't know, that shit affects me still, bro. You know, but nowadays Chipotle doesn't do that. You know, I feel like there was definitely a time where everyone's like, stop rationing the fuck out of all my shit when I'm paying you, you know, but nowadays, you know, it's a little bit better. The worst is like, I was broke as fuck, you know, so like I would only go out to eat like very rarely, you know, and I really like Chipotle. And like, you know, that, that just kind of fucking ruined my experience, bro. But, like, it's not as bad as some of the experiences I've had at Popeye's, bro. Like, there's been times where I'm standing there waiting there for 40 minutes because dudes are on their phones and shit. You know, like, I don't know, bro. I don't know. And, look, I worked at a lot of places like that. Like, I worked a lot of those kinds of jobs. So I'm not really going to bitch about it because, like, I kind of understand how much it sucks. But at the same goddamn time, it's like, bro, I, like, make my fucking food. So my goal is to, like, mix for, like, an hour and then work on making good sounds and music and stuff so <laughs> Any fans, catch you with the twist Now I think I'm on another level, bitch, my life is lit